The gifting system is back, and while it lasts, I actually will be gifting a bunch of skins to my subscribers. Today, I'm gifting skins to three subscribers, and them being Thunder Spits Real, Geyser24, and the Super Max BG. Now, if you also want to get a free gift from me, then all you have to do is first of all, subscribe to the channel, from there drop a like on this video, and also make sure to leave a comment down below telling me your Epic Games username. Make sure to spell it correctly, or otherwise, I cannot give you a free skin. Anyways, let's begin begin with this video. Welcome back to the channel, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far, and in this video I'll be showing you guys the new 14 days of summer event in Fortnite Battle Royale. We're going to take a look at the challenges, free rewards and everything else. I pretty much have all the leaks, information and much more. Anyways, if you are going to enjoy the video, be sure to give the like down below and let's do another like goal on this video. You guys have been smashing these like goals every single time lately. Can we get 7777 likes on this video? If we can reach that like goal, it would make my day and I hope this video does make your day. Now also, subscribe for more videos like these and by the way, I will be replying to each and every single comment down below in the comment section. And if you've turned on your notifications, be sure to comment hashtag notification squad and I will give your comment a heart. Really, I do give your comment a heart. Just try it out yourself right now and you will see it. Your comment is going to get a heart. Anyways, let's get straight into this video. Alright, so we're now a couple of weeks into Season 9 and today the V9.30 update dropped. This update brought us a lot of new content. First of all, players who own the Star Spangled Trooper or the Star Spangled Ranger received new styles. These new styles got added to the game because the 4th of July is coming close. Anyways, these styles definitely look great. From there, a new item got added to the game, the Chuck Splash item. It is a new healing item and this is what it looks like. It's a rare or blue item and it can be found from floor loot, chests, vending machines, supply drops and llamas. It drops in stacks of 2 and you can have a total of 6 of them in one inventory slot. You can actually throw this item and when you do so, it will splash liquid in a small area. And all players within that splash radius will be instantly granted 20 health or shield. Here's a trailer of this item on screen. Then, they also added the new problematic gun to creative, which now allows us to create our own prop at game modes. So, by using the new problematic gun and all the props, you can now play this game or this insane fun game mode with all your friends. And oh yeah, not forget, we received two new islands for creative too, but I don't know if you guys care about that. From there, Epic Games decided to vault a total of three weapons. They vaulted the Boombo, the Dual Pistols and Dynamite. Moving on, we have a major map change, and it actually has something to do with the Polar Peak monster. It destroyed another part of the map once again. This time, it caused chaos at Loot Lake. The monster actually took a bite out of the electricity cables. As of now, Pleasant Park got attacked by the monster, Snobby Shores did get attacked by the monster, and now Loot Lake too. Anyways, regarding leaks, we have a bunch of them. First of all, let's start with the Week 7, Week 8, Week 9, and the Week 10 loading screens and challenges. Here on screen, you can now see all the week 7, 8, 9 and 10 challenges. To be honest, they are not that difficult in my opinion. But if you need more time to read them all out, just pause the video right now and continue watching afterwards. Now, for completing all these challenges, you will unlock all these loading screens right here. Of course, all these loading screens show us a hint towards the location of the free banners and the free battle stars. And then we got an update on the 4 byte challenge. This is what the 4 byte mystery will look like after collecting all the 4 bytes. On this image or puzzle, there's only one 4 byte missing. Anyways, this puzzle reveals a lot. Now if you get over to the Utopia Challenges tab, you will notice that it does say collect 90 4 bytes to unlock the mystery item. The mystery item is actually a legendary skin which would normally cost you 2000 V-Bucks in the item shop. Now guessed or not, but the Utopia skin actually has been revealed by Epic Games themselves. 
where you go over to the style challenges tab, you will find the new singularity challenges. And as you can see, it does say unlocks with 94 bytes in season 9. And after clicking on it, you will see that we're going to be able to unlock the styles too for this skin. This Utopia skin, which is called the Singularity skin, is going to have a total of 3 stages. You first need to collect 94 bytes to get the skin, then for stage 2 you need to collect 95 4 bytes, and in order to get stage number 3 you need to collect all 104 bytes. Now if you guys want me to upload a video here on the channel showing you all the locations of all the 4 bytes, then go ahead and make sure to leave a comment down below right now saying hashtag guide. From there we are receiving 2 new packs or bundles. First of all, we're getting a new Shadow Legends bundle. This bundle will give us 3 skins, 2 bag blanks and 1 wrap. Then we also have a new breakpoint pack including a skin, cosmetics and V-Bucks. But more information about both these packs and bundles coming to the channel soon. Moving on, we have a few upcoming and unreleased game modes or LTMs. They're called the Splashdown LTM and the Tank Battle LTM. The Splashdown LTM is a water balloons game mode only. There are no guns in this game mode, only water balloons and consumable items. Players will be given additional water balloons every few seconds, and to win the match, be the last player standing among a sea of pop balloons. In the tank battle LTM, players have increased maximum health and shield values, and you need to eliminate each other to win. And then, we have three new weapons, which are coming soon to Fortnite Battle Royale. First of all, we're getting an airstrike item. When you throw this item, an area will be hit by an airstrike, possibly killing those in that area. Moving on, we're getting a new drum shotgun. I don't know what to expect from this weapon, but I can tell you already, it's going to be overpowered and it's gonna get vaulted very soon again. And then last, but not least, we're getting the auto revolver in the game. And all these webs are coming out in the next 3 weeks on small little update days. From there, we're getting collaboration between Fortnite and Stranger Things, bringing us a complete new set in the item shop, like I told you guys in my last video. And then last, but not least, we have all the upcoming cosmetics, and as you can see, there are a lot of new skins, new emotes, new wraps, new gliders, new harvesting tools coming to the game. And I mean, there are a lot. We have never gotten this many leaked cosmetics before. There are almost 100 different items. Yes, we're going to get 100 different items in the item shop in the next couple of weeks. And if you decide on getting one of these items in the item shop, make sure to use my supporter carry code SHUFFLEGAMER. That would be appreciated. By the way, if you used my code, leave a comment down below saying I used your code. And I will personally give your comment a heart to show my appreciation towards you. Now, with all that said, let's start with the event. Okay, so as you guys all know, summer is coming along. Summer actually starts in a couple of days from now. Summer officially starts on the 21st of June each year. Now, remember the 14 days of Fortnite event back in December? Well, it was an event in Fortnite during Christmas, which released a new challenge each and every single day. And for completing that challenge, you would unlock a free item. So pretty much, free items for two weeks straight. And guessed or not, but we're receiving a similar event, but then even better, in a couple of days from now. It's going to be called 14 Days of Summer. We're going to get a total of 14 different challenges in order to unlock a total of 15 free items. Let's go through all the free rewards right now. First of all, we have this rare smoothie bag bling. From there, we have this rare deep empty mode. Then, we got this loading screen right here. And from there, we got a new toy, and the toy is actually a water balloon. Then we get this new emoticon, which is actually an animated one. So that's something brand new. From there, we have a spray of the sun, and we have this amazing wrap. It's an uncommon wrap named the Neon Tropics. From there, we have our second loading screen, and we have our first banner. Then we have reward number 10, and this is actually a spray. From there, we have a rare harvesting tool by the name of Low and Slow, and also we're going to get the Beach Balls Control, and this quad pack bag bling. And then last, but not least, we're getting a new music pack and another banner icon. So, those are all the 15 free items or rewards that we can unlock by completing the 14 days of summer challenges. By now, you're probably wondering what are all these challenges going to be. Well, right here, we have all the challenges with the rewards you get from it. Let's go through all of them right now. By the way, a complete guide for all these 14 challenges will be uploaded to my second channel. So, make sure to check out my second channel if you need help with them. Anyways, the challenges are Dance at different beach parties Bounce a giant beach ball in different matches Eliminations with a daily involved weapon or a drum gun Thank the bus driver and finish top 20 in different matches Pop party balloon decorations Search unicorn floaties at swimming holes Hit the player with a water balloon in different matches Score trick points with a drift board with the Neon Tropics applied to it 
launch fireworks found along the river bank, get a score of 10 or more at the carnival clown board, visit a giant beach umbrella and a huge rubber ducky in a single match, search the hidden seashell in the beach themed loading screen, and destroy grills with the low and slow harvesting tool. Now I'm looking forward to this event, a release date is still unknown, but I think this Friday or next week Friday we can expect the star. I will keep you guys up to date here on the channel. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. But with all that being said, always remember, this was Shovel Gamer, and I am signing out.